what is that? I don't like that. What is going on? So I have my fall candle burning over there. I'm just in the mood for fall and I have all these new fall clothing items that I want to show you guys. So instead of doing like a sit down fall haul, I figured I would just go ahead and try all these items on because I actually haven't tried any of them on yet. So it's going to be kind of like a first impressions kind of thing. So we're going to do a little fashion show, fashion show, fashion show at lunch kind of situation. I'll try it on. Fashion show, fashion show, fashion show at lunch. But before we get started, I wanted to thank Shop Tagger for sponsoring today's video. If you guys don't know what Shop Tagger is, it's an essential online tool that if you guys go online shopping, you need this on your browser. It's a free web app that notifies you when the product that you want goes on sale or comes back into stock. So basically how I use it is that I always have like a running wish list of things that I want and I never want to just buy it, you know, straight away. I want it to like kind of sit there for a little bit and make sure that I actually want it. So in the meantime, I will go on shop tagger add it to my list and then whenever it goes on sale it's like way better than just like if I were to buy it right away then it wouldn't be on sale shop tagger takes the stress out of online shopping because they actually scan the entire internet for coupons it makes it so easy because you don't have to do the work of actually finding the coupon a shop tagger will scan the entire internet for you and find you the best coupons and they will apply the coupons at checkout saving you a ton of money and shop tagger actually just launched a new cashback feature that if you shop at specific stores you get money sent to your PayPal account. So it's basically just free money that's being sent to your PayPal and who doesn't want free money when they online shop? Like I feel like if I'm gonna be shopping online, it would be great to get some cash back. So I will leave a link to Shop Tagger down below so you guys can download it and start saving some money. So with that said, I am gonna jump into this video. I'm gonna just show you guys everything that I picked up and try them on and you guys can tell me if I should keep it or not. But anyways, okay, let's get started. So what I'm gonna do is go through each like category, show you guys them and then I will try them on after. So the first one that I have are dresses and I'm not usually a dress kind of girl like I just I don't know I used to be but I just haven't really been a dress person so I picked this guy up and I know what you guys are thinking you're probably like this is totally summer vibes like what is she doing and Although it is, I also think this can be transitioned into fall, especially where I live. And I saw for fall 2020 trends that yellow is a really big trend. So when I saw this at Anthropology, I gravitated towards it and I just love it. I think it's so beautiful. I love the eyelet detail and just how flowy and like frilly it is. I think it's adorable. And the next three dresses are from Target. And this one is so beautiful. Something else that is a fall trend is the baby doll dresses. I remember like back in the day, I used to love baby doll dresses. So I'm glad that they're coming back. And I love this paisley print and just like the color of it definitely is fall vibes. So really like that. So this next dress is this gorgeous brown kind of metallic finished dress. And again, this is a baby doll dress, but something else that is a fall trend is brown. Like I know brown is usually like a fall color, but this year it's very big. So I really like this. And this is also from Target. Okay, this is the last dress. And I, I don't know how it's gonna look like on me. It might not look that good, but I really love this blue color. And another trend is metallics. And this one has a nice little metallic finish. And another thing that I wanted to point out is that you don't have to go by fall trends. You don't even have to like, listen to them at all. You can wear whatever makes you happy and that whatever you feel good in. I have just recently been reflecting on my personal style and I just, I don't know, I just want like a little bit of a change. So I'm kind of like dipping my toe into different trends to see what sticks and what I actually like. So I just think this is like a fun video to, you know, experiment with. But yeah, so I'm going to try all of these dresses on and you guys will have to tell me which one you guys like the best. Fashion show. Fashion show. Fashion show at lunch. Guys, this dress is actually so cute and I love how it fits. I just... I don't know, I just feel like a little prairie girl, but also just like kind of stylish too. I like the pairing of the Doc Martens with this like more girly, fun dress. Also this dress has pockets, which is definitely a plus. So loving that. We're gonna try this guy on. Okay, I actually really like this dress as well. I'm loving this baby doll trend. I'm probably going to keep this one, honestly, because I love how it fits. I think it's so flowy and so girly. And I also really like this little tie in the front. I think it's so adorable. And then again, I paired them with my docs. I think it does give it a nice little edge to it. I love like the whole like girly, but then making it a little edgy with the shoes. Love that. And yeah, I think this one is adorable. What do you guys think? 
Okay, my shoes are like making so much noise. Okay, once again, love the baby doll dress. Big fan. I think I'm going to love all of these. You know what? This is a, this is the mystery one though. I'm not sure if this one will look cute, so stay tuned. I'm really loving this collar as well. I just think this fits really nice and so like dainty and cute, and I'm really here for it. I'm just 2020 is the year of the dresses, I think, for Leah personally. I'm here for it. So I love like the puffy sleeve. I love that it's a long sleeve. I just love this paisley print and how short and like flirty and fun it is. And again, I paired them with my docks. I have white docks that would probably look good with this as well. I just thought that this gave it a more like fall vibe. And yeah, I'm really digging it. So you guys will have to let me know out of the three which one you guys like the best. But we are trying on the last one and we will see how this goes. Also, they all have pockets so far, so big fan. Also, this one has pockets. Okay, this is going to be a no for me, dog, because I feel like I'm in scrubs. And I don't know if it's just because it's too big or if this is just a look and it looks awful on me. <laughs> I'm not sure. But I'm going to have to say no for me. I love, like, the flowiness of it, but I think it's just too big, you know? So I'm just not a fan. I feel like I'm in scrubs, right? It kind of looks like scrubs. But anyways, I want to know your guys' thoughts. And let me know out of those four what dress you like the best. And now we're going to move on to pants. I have four different types of pants. I have three colored ones and then one pattern pant. This first one is from Urban Outfitters. And I just love the whole like cargo pant trend. And when I saw these, these were on sale. So I figured I would just pick them up. They have some detailing on the bottom, like some zippers. So you can also like have it zipped. So that's cool. It has like this ruching on the top. And maybe I can pair them with one of these shirts that I picked up as well. This is also from Urban Outfitters. I love this color. This is also, like I said, yellow is a really big trend for fall. Okay, next up we have, again, kind of like this marigold, kind of golden yellow colored pant, and it's a wide leg pant. Really excited about these ones. And then this one over here is like this orangey red kind of color, and they're like the cargo pants, but they're very like thin material, so also excited about that. I think that these are beautiful colors for the fall time. And then lastly, we have this one. This is from Urban Outfitters, and I absolutely love this print. I think this is so gorgeous for the fall time, and I love that it's kind of like bell bottom on the bottom, but it's not like too much bell bottom, you know? So I'm gonna go ahead and pair these with different tops and come right back. Okay, these are my new favorite pants. I am obsessed with these. These are so 70s, which if you guys know, that's like truly my love is like 70s fashion, 70s, architecture 70s home decor just like everything 70s i love i've kind of started to like get away from that a little bit with like my style but i i just keep returning i cannot get away from the 70s vibes i paired this outfit with some of my converse and then just an oversized harley tee i think this is a great like casual fall vibe it is a great transition outfit because i can definitely wear this in the upcoming season and not be like super hot but then also you know look a little fall i'm gonna try on the other pants right now and we will see what we think okay guys i'm here for this casual oversized look this is kind of like what my inner self is screaming that I want to wear 24 seven. Like I love all the different styles and I will continue to wear like different things, but like my inner peace begins with wearing stuff like this. Like this is me, like this is literally me, like my dad's shoes, are they dad's shoes? I don't know, they're just like cool like Nikes, some cool cargo pants and like an oversized shirt and like I'm here, I'm doing well. Like I love, I don't know, I just love this outfit so much. I don't know if you guys like it, but I'm just like here for this. I had these Nikes for so long. I got them like right before quarantine, so I haven't really worn them at all, but I really love them. I got them from Urban and these pants are from Urban. This shirt is thrifted. It's just a Nike thrifted top. And I really love this color for fall. It's like a nice burnt orange, really digging it. So yes, I'm going to try on the other two pants and we will see how I style them. So I think I'm veering a little bit away from like the fall trends at the moment, and I'm just stepping into my own. I just love this look so much. So I really like these pants, and I paired them with just this thrifted top that I thrifted a while ago. It has some flames, and then I'm just wearing them with my Air Force Ones. Just like the last outfit, I'm very much comfortable in this kind of style. But also, I wanted to show you guys what the little shirt looks like underneath. This is one that I got from Urban Outfitters. Wow, guys, it's so hot. My air conditioning is off currently because it's too loud. But we got this little tank top. I think this is freaking adorable. I definitely will keep this. I think it's so cute. And it also kind of looks good with this outfit. Like, 
kind of loving this it kind of reminds me of like nascar like those kind of colors so also love this okay now i'm going to try on the last pair so I paired these pants with this cream colored crop top as well as this corduroy jacket that I thrifted and as well as my Converse and I just like the whole like monochrome, it's not monochromatic but it's like the same hues of colors all incorporated and this would definitely be like a transition outfit I feel like for fall because it's it definitely could be worn in the summer but then also like fall, you know? I definitely would recommend these pants. These are only $25 from Target and they're like really high quality and I love how they flare out at the bottom. I think it's super cute. So moving on, we have three more items left and this is a sweater from Target and I just love how funky and different this is and a zebra print is something that is also very much in for the fall 2020 season. So I have this sweater. I think this is just so fun. It's like purple and black very unexpected and something that I definitely don't have in my wardrobe. And then again with the zebra print, I have this skirt that I found from Urban Outfitters. And yeah, zebra print as well as just animal print in general is in for fall 2020. I feel like it's always in, but especially for this year is zebra. And then lastly, I have this tennis skirt, which was a huge trend in summer. But paired with a sweatshirt, it will also go well for the fall time. And this is one that I got from Thread Up, And they had a ton of tennis skirts on there and they're way cheaper on there. So definitely check there if you're in the market for a nice little tennis skirt. So I'm going to style these and come right back. Okay, this is my new favorite sweater. This is not itchy at all. It's so soft and very comfortable. And I just love the funky vibes of it all. And I paired it with the same orange pants as before. And I just love like the contrast. I think it's so funky, so fun, so fresh really digging it so i'm definitely gonna leave this link down below because i feel like if you like this you guys should definitely pick it up because it's just so soft and just like a fun little like vibe you know i also paired this outfit with some white docks and i think it goes really well together i think it could also be paired with something else but i had these white docks laying around so you know i decided to pull them out so now i'm going to try on these last two skirts okay so this is what i call my tiktok outfit because this is 100 inspired by the tiktokers of the world you know i i that's all I have to say about this outfit, honestly. I really like it. I think it's fun, flirty, just like, you know, just like a fun little vibe. So I just paired this skirt with this Guess Jeans crew neck that I thrifted at the Rose Bowl. And then I also paired it with my Air Force Ones and I just think it's a vibe. You know, I definitely feel young in this outfit, but I'm definitely channeling my inner 18 year old with this outfit, not hating it. So yeah, <laughs> that's it. Okay, I'm gonna try on the last skirt and then we are done. So I paired the zebra skirt again with the same crew neck, same fit, you know? I just thought it looked really good together and I'm really liking this like crew neck and skirt situation and I think with these colors, they really go well together. And I think the TikTokers are actually onto something with this, so I'm just going with it. I'm liking it and you guys will have to let me know what your guys thoughts on this pairing so that's it for this video I really hope you guys liked it it was something different that I haven't really done before so if you guys liked it make sure to give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to check out shop tagger down below in the description and that's gonna be it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys in my next one peace let her know I gotta let her know that she my white horse she my medical she like my baby mom know how to Care with me, get my baby problems. You gon' regret everything. So I let him know, gotta let him know. Came through the front door.